so hi everyone welcome back to data science in your pocket and as you can see on my screen google has released another bomb of a model and they have released a third version of Gini, that is Gini 3 if you don't know Gini has been their model for world generation that means interactive game generation you can see that it is generating an entire environment where the object can also move so let's first of all see a few examples and then we will jump on to the technical details of the model what they have released here you can see that how this particular water boat is moving and you can see all the scenes the movement is also present hence this is called as interactable 3d worlds the previous two models genie 1 and genie 2 were also good but this looks to be amazing and the quality that it generates is just killer you can see it is also able to generate realistic views this is quite real it is just not a game anymore as you can see in this one this is underwater scene you saw a real world scene on a night scene and whatnot it is just crazingly good and i'll be showing you all the other demos also that the team has released as you can see on my screen this is a chopper view and this also looks quite realistic and can move in 360 direction as you can see not just that as you can see in the next one it is also able to emulate the natural environment natural bodies trees water and whatnot because the previous models that has been released are mostly towards gaming but this looks to be quite realistic and can be a game changer for vr technology this is very much similar to the previous video we saw but multiple objects are coming here underwater see this one this is quite nice it has multiple complex architectures also coming in rocks are there and a person is able to move in any direction it wants to this is a close-up view of leaves as you can see so it's not just able to create distant objects but also close objects as well and now our favorite part it is also able to generate gaming worlds as you can see fictional characters are moving in a fictional world which is quite interesting as you can see even if you look into this sample this looks to be really out of a game and a high quality game as you can see it is moving in multiple directions and moving in multiple lighting also from sunlight to darkness you can see this it's promptable too if you read this one choose a world setting then pick up an event and see genie 3 create it so for example let's pick london and let's pick a dragon here you can see that it is able to let's click on dragon now and you can see it is able to mix both the things this is quite interesting what a demo let me try out it first solution the environment is getting loaded and now you then you can add a event as well so let me add a green tractor now where is the green tractor i can't see yeah the tractor is now coming so it is also able to add objects in the environment which is quite interesting for me so i think we have seen enough demos now let's jump on to the technical details of the model and then we will wrap this up so google DeepMind has released genie 3 a new frontier for world models so what are the key features it is a real-time interaction at 25 fps 720 pixel resolution that's the greatest part and text to world generation this is a new term that i'm listening to text to audio i've heard but text to world that means you give it a prompt and it is able to generate a world out of it an interactive world talking about the key capabilities it has real-time interaction high resolution and quite consistent for several minutes the environment remained consistent Modeling physics properties, I think, experience natural phenomena in real time as we saw in most of the demos. Fluid dynamics, dynamics are followed, lighting effects are followed, and environment interaction can be seen in the model. I think we just saw a few examples and that were quite crazy. 
simulating the natural world we saw some examples for that too animal behavior would be observed plant life weather systems and what not this looks to be quite complex of a model modeling animation and fiction fantastical scenarios character animation artistic styles it can do everything even talking about the environmental consistency it has a visual memory so for a video like up to one minute it remembers the previous events also auto regressive in nature that means it generates the image one by one in the video and extended duration environments remain consistent for minutes they won't glitch out promptable world events i think we just now saw you can add rain snow other events in your video itself as you are seeing that dragon in london example healing embodied agent research i think with such a innovation coming it will help in multiple direction goal directed behavior agent pursue objectives in generated world complex task execution and it is the part to ej that's for sure Talking about the next steps, the future of world models, obviously for education and training, no doubt about it. Agent development and training, and it is a critical step in path to AGI. With this, it's a wrap. I hope you try to read the blog. It is still in research mode. Hence, the model is not released, but they have just released a demo. Looks quite interesting, and I hope you try it out.